In a legal drama that's sending shockwaves through the online world, special counsel Jack Smith is at the center of a heated battle against social media giant Twitter. The case, related to the federal charges against former President Donald Trump for his involvement in the January 6 events, has raised questions about privacy, free speech, and the reach of legal authority. A recently unsealed court document reveals the depth of the conflict. Smith's team demanded Twitter surrender a trove of President Trump's account data, including direct messages, deleted content, and even users' location information who interacted with his account. This demand was backed by a warrant and a non-disclosure order, signed by U.S. District Judge Beryl Howell. However, Twitter didn't comply silently. It challenged the warrant and non-disclosure order, asserting its rights to free speech and contesting the evidence's sufficiency. The courtroom clash escalated when Judge Howell upheld both orders and subsequently sanctioned Twitter for not meeting the data handover deadline. This showdown has sparked intense discussions about the balance between legal authority and digital privacy, as well as the limitations social media platforms face when grappling with law enforcement requests. As the legal saga unfolds, experts and the public alike ponder the implications of this case on the future of online privacy and the boundaries of governmental access to personal